Courtesy Dock at Sundowners, Yacht Club of St. Louis. Naked eye, can't see the boat. Is that what time it is? No, no. We'll zoom in at a boat. 2.30. And you can see the lights, but not the boat. Looking upstream, bolter shoot to the left. Now see on and the actual view. His last system, you couldn't turn the infrared off. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if I pan left, you'll see Yacht Club of St. Louis. See the lights. We'll rotate and show you what that looks like with the night vision. You can see the lights. Naked eye, I can make out a little bit of the wall of the building. And now we'll rotate. Go back to the unit. And that's what you're going to see. In the uh, I don't think we need to do any uh, software tweaks for you, bud. Okay, we're looking downstream Darting Slough, just below uh, Yacht Club of St. Louis. On the port side, you'll see the lights from Lake Center coming up. Go ahead and rotate left. Lights from Lake Center. We're about three quarters of a mile off. The far end of Dardine Slough where it makes a bend to Eagles Landing. And again, real-time view. You can see a couple dots there. That's Lake Center, trust me. Oh, man. What's that tower down there? The power line's going across. Oh, that's a big tower, man. Power line's going across just above Lake Center. See the tower real well. Naked eye, the sky is pretty much... Uh, Navy blue to black. Okay, we just entered the mouth of Yacht Club Harbor. Just kind of letting the boat drift a little bit. Right now, sensor only. Rotating right to center us. And that's sensor only. Sensor only. Wait for the boat to rotate. Now we're looking right down the runway and adding infrared. Infrared's on, see the washout at first, but then everything else crisps up. I'm going to rotate back left a little. That's with infrared. Turn the infrared off again. We got street lights to help us. Infrared's off. Rotate right, look down the runway. This is what the naked eye is seeing. There's the docks right next to us.